come on, man. Y'all gotta be quicker than that. You gotta be on your toes. How did y'all not hear that helicopter coming? Oh, that's pretty cool how they did that. <laughs> Dang, bro. They ain't playing. Come on, bro. You didn't have to make this dude handicapped. <laughs> What the hell? That boy is a G. Hell no, I definitely wouldn't do that. Shoot, I'll be running out that damn door. I apologize for putting you in this position. You trained him well. Shoot, that's all you're gonna say, man? He's obviously really close to him. Welcome to Kingsman. <laughs> I'll deal with this mess, personally. Shouldn't that dude be like in pieces? He was on top of a grenade. Respect though. If only that man was Captain America. I would like to present you with this Medal of Valor. I don't want your help. I want my husband back. What's your name, young man? Exy. Hello, Exy. You take care of this, Exy. All right. Damn, just disrespectful. The mama said no. He's like, man, f you. I'm gonna go with this kid. Seem like he's gonna be more cooperative. I would have lost that thing, bro. How you gonna trust a kid with something like that? That was some beautiful music right there. Mark, Mark Hamill. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Yo, this is one hell of a cameo. You've made a mistake. I'm a university lecturer. I've got no money. So I guess this dude's British accent is just talking like the Joker. Oh, this whiskey, it's amazing. You will <laughs> uh, I don't want to drink something that's gonna make me <laughs> sir. I wanna drink something that's gonna <laughs> me up, but not like that. I'm trying to get lit up in here. I suppose asking to borrow a cup of sugar is a step too far. <laughs> The accuracy is insane. Oh my God. Please, please don't show it. Oh my goodness. What's up, is that fine ass woman from the mummy? Yeah, that brother's starving. <laughs> Can you hold these? Huh. Yo, that's one hell of a cut, man. Everything is clean. Of course he's in this movie. <laughs> I'm so sorry you had to witness all this unpleasantness. See, that's funny as hell. This dude got this list, man. Who decided for this man to have this list? I like that character introduction though. Dang, I guess I should have wore a suit for this. Awesome. Oh, snap. The ultimate Kingsman. I think that's perfect casting, man. Gentlemen. What the To Lancelot. To Lancelot. Damn, this is strong. I want each of you to propose a candidate and have them report to UKHQ no later than 9 p.m. GMT. Merlin, come in. I wonder if he's gonna be the villain, because this dude is like always the villain. Lancelot was investigating a group of mercenaries who were experimenting with biological weaponry. So what happened to Lancelot? He tracked them to this property in Argentina. While he had them under surveillance, he became aware they defected a kidnapping. So he executed a solo rescue mission, which failed. So he didn't want to tell anybody about his mission? What's curious is he's not actually missing. That's that dude Mark Hamill would have a photo like that. <laughs> 17 years and still evolving with the times remains an entirely foreign concept to you. Seems like you haven't aged a day in 17 years. Mm, I think that's smart. Yeah, wear it as a necklace? Hell yeah. I still would have lost it, though. <laughs> Boy, look like an up and crumbing rapper. Why don't you take this, go get some Rizzlers, get yourself some sweets. And while you're gone, we'll show your mother how free can be good company. <laughs> nah, nah, I, I wouldn't accept that shit, bro. I'm throwing them hands after that. Freaking slamming that table on you. About to run on the wall and stuff. I'm going crazy. She was never the same after his father died. Oh, I thought that dude was about to walk in there. He was like, I'm gonna get my turn in too. One of these days, I'm gonna smash his face in. Are you mental, cuz? He just get that lot to do you and then pretend you knew nothing. Why are you pointing, bro? <laughs> you right there. You think you can chat about us and we won't do nothing just because our governor's banging eggs his mum? What? Yeah. Didn't yeah, understand a word he just said. It is kind of sad that there are people that actually live Pretty their life like that, you know? Being in the same house with their mother and the mother is pretty much a prostitute. Freezing. Why are we walking? You jacked his f***ing car keys, bruv. Yeah, now we're gonna nick his car. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, know, I would love to do some donuts, man. They just asking to get murdered. Asking to get done in, bruv. I like it, 
Yo, it was like Fast and Furious, bruv. Yo, for my UK fans, what is your favorite thing to do at home, man? I've never been to London or the UK, so I can't wait to go, though. I'll sort this guy out of the car. It's a guy out of the f***ing car! Yeah, like the cops is not gonna see them get out the car. Okay. All right. That was stupid. Trying to stand up for your boys. They're not gonna give a damn about you in a couple years. I want to exercise my right to a phone call. Oh, it's the dude from The Witch. He was the dad. He doesn't even remember what to say. Oxford's not broke. What?! Your complaint has been duly noted, and we hope that we have not lost you as a loyal customer. I really don't know how he would remember that, because he didn't even tell him that. The dude was kind of like whispering that to his mother. Exit. Damn, what well, this is happening so quick. My name is Harry Hart, and I gave you that medal. So where was you posted, Iraq or something? Sorry, Exit, classified. So what are we supposed to be talking about? What can we talk about? The day your father died, I missed something. And if it went for his courage, my mistake would have cost the lives of every man present. So I owe him. Really? That explosion really didn't have that much of a radius. I think all y'all would have been fine, to be honest. But I understand he kind of covered the radius uh, of the explosion. Huge IQ, great performance at primary school. And it all went tits up. <laughs> tits up, bruv. We ain't got much choice. You get me? What the f*** are you doing here? You taking a piss? Isn't this a coincidence that we're sitting in the exact same booth in the exact same pub that these guys are in? I thought they went somewhere else. Yeah, what's up with this wardrobe, though? No day. It's crazy. So you... I'd appreciate it enormously if you could just leave us in peace until I finish this lovely pint of Guinness. Hmm. Kingsman, brought to you by Guinness. Never had Guinness. I know Conan loves Guinness. Manners maketh man. Hmm. Never heard that phrase before. Then let me teach you a lesson. I like how they shot that. Oh my god. Don't tell me he killed him with that one shot. That shit was clean. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> oh my god, that tooth was dirty. Boy, he needed to go to the dentist. Yo, what the hell? It looked like they CGI'd his face or something. <laughs> that dude was like, damn, bruv. That's not supposed to stop me. Yo, this is crazy. What the hell? They got like certain synchronization in this damn scene. Yo, the editing in this is crazy. <laughs> oh my God. What? <laughs> That's one of the best action scenes I've ever seen, bro. Now, I do apologize, Eggsy. I shouldn't have done this in front of you. No, please. Whoa, no, whoa, what the hell is that? Is that your way of a neuralizer? Go and tell us all. I'll say feds, I've never grasped anyone up. I've heard some rumors that the guy who plays Eggsy uh, has been in like some talks to play Wolverine in the MCU, but hasn't really been no legitimacy to that because it's just been like a lot of fan rumors. Ah! God damn, sir. You're not even my dad. I don't know you f***ing on about. Ah! I knew he put a tracker on him. Yo, you doing way too much, sir. What, are they coming after you? I suggest you leave the boy alone or I shall be forced to deliver it to the appropriate authorities. No, Exit. that dude deserves to be you locked up, man, for what he's done to my mom. What are you doing here, bro? I cannot catch a break, man. Leave me alone. Of course, he can do parkour. Oh my god, that boy's smooth with it. I would love to do parkour, man, but I'm just afraid of heights and afraid of busting my ass. What do you see? Someone who wants to know what the f Somebody who on. needs to learn how to dress? I see a young man with potential. Did you see the film Trading Places? No. Yeah, yeah, I just watched it. How about Nikita? Nah, never heard of it. The lack of a silver spoon has set you on a certain path, but you needn't stay on it. You can transform. You know, like in My Fair Lady. Hmm. Yes. Was, is that a movie? Right. I haven't seen that either. So I'm offering you the opportunity to become a Kingsman. Interested? You think I've got anything to lose? Oh, that's interesting. I thought we was going to go through that whole trope of him being like, hell no, I don't want this. And he uh, has something happen that changes his mind. And he's like, oh, you know, yeah, I'll go ahead and be a Kingsman now. And so began a rather venture. An independent international intelligence agency operating at the highest level of discretion. So what's the difference between Kingsman and the MI6? How deep does this f***ing thing go? Deep enough. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> 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 
damn for real travel like a whole different country in just a couple minutes really he was going fast as hell Oh, snap, it's like the men in black right here. My name is Merlin. You are about to embark on what is probably the most dangerous job interview in the world. I love that their agent code names are uh, historic knights. Or I don't even think Merlin is a knight. Was Merlin like a mage or something like that? I forget. I'm sorry. I'll just say people dealing in medieval times. As well as your agreement to strict confidentiality, which incidentally, if you break, will result in you and your next of kin being in that bag. What? Hell no. Are you serious right now, bro? This must be a joke. Roxanne, but call me Roxy. Oh, hell yeah. Eggie. I'll call you anything you Eggie. want, girl. Eggie, where do they dig you up? Of course, you, you know, hate him. No need to bite his head off. Charlie's only making conversation, right, Charlie? Hey, can I at least have like five minutes with a girl by myself before you start cock blocking? Hell, hating. Did you serve me at the McDonald's in Winchester service station? Wow, no. okay. But if I had, I'd have given you an extra open a secret sauce. <laughs> it's just scare tactics. No one's gonna die. <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> Nobody told me to try and save the planet. I wanted to. So I spent the last two years trying to find a real solution. Go oh, on, Mr. Valentine. I'm still listening. <laughs> That's the best Obama impression that y'all can get? <laughs> sound like somebody in a video game trying to sound like Obama. Dang, I got the toilets just out in the open like that? What if somebody got the bubble guts? Just got diarrhea, man. <laughs> they overthinking this whole thing, man. They all trying to show out. Is anybody gonna like break the window or the mirror? That's what I'm talking about, boy. Take initiative, man. As far as I'm concerned, every single one of you has failed. You all forgot the most important thing, teamwork. Somebody died? Oh, not the other girl, what? Yeah, that's messed up. Y'all didn't even want to pass the freaking pipes around for everybody to get some air. And y'all don't even want to even try to like rest, like do CPR on her and bring her back. They're just gonna leave her there. My colleague died trying to rescue you and I'm sure you saw how well trained he was. So I suggest you tell me who kidnapped you and why they let you go. I barely touched you. Oh man. Oh my God, that is gross, bro. Oh, that's nasty. How do you even cope in a situation like that? You're gonna pick a puppy. Wherever you go, your dog goes. Oh yeah, I want the shepherd so I can be like, I am legend. A pug. It's a bulldog, innit? What? No? You don't know anything about dogs? Who told you that was a bulldog? <laughs> Ain't that some shit. Man, you got a hard-headed dog, bro. <laughs> Oh, yo, that's not what we about to be doing. He's like, hey, he's like, hey bro, just chill out, bro. Let's talk about this for a second. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? You know, it's unbelievable. You're still here, lingering like some big steaming sh that just went flush. Roger that. Target identified. And how about you shut the fuck up? <laughs> hey, at least they making this whole thing interesting and entertaining, man. It's not boring. A lot of trash talk. And I really, really appreciate you traveling all this way, your royal highness. <laughs> and you too, <laughs> I think this is Oh my quite god. Brilliant. You are completely crazy. Of course, Karen wouldn't be so accepting of this whole thing. I barely touched you. Oh my god. Oh! Release the princess! Oh my god, that is scary as hell, bro. What the hell? <laughs> oh, how the hell is she so fast? She kind of remind me of that one chick in that Quentin Tarantino movie. I think it's a Quentin Tarantino movie. The girl who has like a assault rifle as a leg. King hell. <laughs> That's his rank, Harry. This is wicked. The IP address I traced it to is registered to the Valentine Corporation. Oh, that's not much of a lead. He has millions of employees worldwide. So I guess he built his way up where he can hide under people's noses. Every man, woman, and child can claim a free SIM card compatible with any cell phone and utilize my communications network for free. I don't think this will work. Like, wouldn't this dude have a big target on his back from all these different companies making so much money? They would try to find a way to shut this dude down unless he found a way to Valentine's pay them off. System. Yo, this movie is fire, bro. <laughs> 
I was not expecting this. This is so interesting. It's okay. I've done it before. It's probably why I can think of it. It's gonna be all right. Be top of the class. Yeah, yeah, you gotta spit that game, you feel me? Actually, I really don't think I can do this. See, just hold my hand, baby. You know, be close to me and I got you. Yeah, let the stupid dudes go first. We can learn what not to do. Oh my God, I cannot wait to skydive, bro. This stuff's like so freaking fun. Now, I know I said I'm afraid of heights, but this is the only thing I would love to do when it comes to heights because I just want to feel that sense of flying. Now, I understand he was talking about teamwork and all that, but didn't he say not to get caught by his scanners? So why would we all bunch up together? A Kingsman agent needs to be able to solve problems under pressure, like what to do when one of your group has no parachute. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you it's Roxy. She doesn't have the parachute. Grab the clips and flash them too. Rufus, come on. Oh, fuck. Come on, stop being scary, bro. What? Are you sick? That was dumb as hell. How are you scared? All we doing is just partnering up together. Great job building the tension right here, man. No matter what happens now, I've got you, all right? Pull the parachute. Y'all talking too much. Oh, good job. Oh, they're not there. Them knees are gone. Them ankles and them knees are dead. Sorry, sir, but why the f did you choose me as the gimp? You have a complaint. You come here and you whisper it in my ear. Because he's going to show him that he actually did have a parachute. <laughs> I, like, I don't understand why he think he will have y'all go without a parachute. It's crazy. It's a pleasure to meet you. Anybody willing to donate that much deserves their own dinner. Ah, uh, nah. I wouldn't know. accept that. I hope you're hungry. I'm famished. Good. McDonald's? Oh my God. <laughs> Disrespectful. The way I'm dressed like this. Well, I guess Kingsman brought to you by McDonald's. My like, God, Lee, they got so many sponsors. You like spy movies, Mr. DeVille? Oh, when I was a kid, that was my dream job. Gentleman spy. See, but then you had that lisp and it was like, I don't know about this. What a shame we both had to grow up. Yeah, everybody, man. And I hate it. People got to give up on their dreams. And thank you for such a happy meal. <laughs> That's a good one. I like that dad joke. It was nice. Really don't know how oblivious they are to a lot of this stuff, though, man. I would have been had some suspicions like this dude might know who I am or whatever. Like, I definitely want to drink no wine. That's just one thing that I learned. I, I don't drink anything from anybody anymore because the world has just gotten so weird. Your mission is to use your NLP training to win over the individual on the photograph in your envelope. And when I say win over, I do mean in the biblical sense. Is that the we'll same girl? That, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, I see. Shoot, we can get a group thing in. Excuse me, negging. Saying something negative to a pretty girl in order to undermine her social value. <laughs> it's supposed to make you want to win his approval. You know, if you're into seduction techniques, this guy is textbook. See what he just did? It's called an opinion opener. What are y'all doing? What is this? Just have a normal conversation with her. Y'all overthinking this whole thing. Have y'all never talked to somebody? Wow, ain't that some dude. He did say something about the champagne. My employer's got two questions for you, Eggsy. What the fuck is Kingsman? And who's Harry Hart? Oh yeah, yeah, I, I would already knew that this was the whole training thing, bro. Cause like, how do you know my name? And how do you know about Kingsman? Come on now. Congratulations. Bloody well done. <laughs> I mean, y'all made it easy. Okay. Them questions Boxing were past stupid. Past Just the King is Arthur. Arthur's head of a spy agency. It's cool Kingsman. Get me out of here. So y'all gotta kill him, right? Charlie, time to go home. Fucking dad's gonna hear about this. Man, what is your dad gonna have he against the freaking Kingsman? Dad. So you're gonna teach me how to talk proper like a my fair lady? I kind of always wanted those Adidas growing up, but nowadays I'm not really into Adidas shoes like that, unless it's like superstars or something. Maybe some basketball shoes. Kingsman suits are always bulletproof. So let's get you measured. And then whether you get the job or not, you'll have a lasting and useful memento of your time at Kingsman. That's a great and gift from the Kingsman, man. Oh, yes. Very, very nice. <laughs> Yo, if I could build something like this in my house, I definitely would. Now do your very best impersonation of a German aristocrat's formal greeting. I think you're joking with me. No, exit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, okay. How do I get it back in? Very carefully. Dang, I can't, like, come up with some new technology where uh, I don't have to worry about something like that? Mr. DeVere! I was 
thirsting for that dope ass smoking jacket you had on. I mean, What's can up, you take man? the hat off? You know, isn't it rude to have your hat on indoors? Now I understand Eggsy has his hat on, so. Have you had any chance to think further on my proposal? Most definitely. My people will be getting in touch with you very soon. I guarantee it. Ha, ah, that's nice that he said that in a uh, suit shop. I heard that they can't say I guarantee it anymore. Gazelle! Let's go ascotting. Well, come on. Don't make me. I'm about to say, yeah, why are they focusing on the hat? Okay. Why would you do I that? Did. God, y'all play too much over here in Kingsman, bro. Shoot the dog. So yeah, go ahead and this do it, bro. It's part of the mission. That's all for the greater good. That dude just standing there like, man, just pull the trigger. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> like, all right, all right, all right. Are you really going to pull it or not? Do it. Do it, mother Pull the trigger. Get out. I knew you couldn't make it. What? That, that's Why would y'all want me to kill the dog, uh -huh. bro? Even though it probably was blanks in there. What was the whole point of that? I guess it's uh, like if I uh, guess somebody was to turn on us and, you know, you had a close relationship with them. If you actually had the balls to shoot them. Exe, please, please just don't get nah, involved. I should never have left you on your own. This stops right now. You want to have a word with me? You get out of that cab, I'll knock you straight back down on your fucking ass. Go on, lads. There'll be two hits. Me oh, okay. Me All right. He's really going to shoot me a fair one. All right. I'm surprised. Want a bit of me? What are you doing? Oh, no, 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 no. Why would you do this, bro? You ain't going to let me fight. I understand you mad I stole the car, but come on now. Some bullshit. This dude should have been got his ass whooped. You shot a dog just to get a f job. Yes, I did. Mr. Pickle here reminds me of that every time I take a sh What? That's sick. And you got it in the bathroom. It was a blank. Exit. It was a f***ing blank. I mean, can y'all give me another chance? Like, how, how can I get back into Kingsman then? Merlin, get the plane ready. Well, there. You just stay right there. I'll sort this mess out when I get back. Y'all gotta stop doing stuff by yourself, man. Y'all need a partner or something. You do not have to be a Jew. I never. Oh, my God. Jew. Golly. This dude just saying all the slurs, bro. Not even making no damn sense. Oh, he's leaving. I'm starting to test now. I'm not surprised that she's over there trying to follow him and make a scene. Bro, backhand that bitch. Oh my God, are you kidding me? I don't think he really meant to do that. What the? Oh my God. Oh my fucking God. <laughs> Shit. Oh my. Yo, who is the director? Is this shit just fun? Bro, what the f <laughs> oh my God. Oh my So this dude's freaking Sims cards makes people violent? Why? What does this have to do with climate change? I guess he's, this is his way of doing population control? God damn. So even if you don't have the phones, you can still be uh, brainwashed. Oh my God. So everyone's been affected, whether they have a Sim card or not. And we get the added benefit of wiping out the kingdom. Not yet. My God, <laughs> this sh is fire. This is crazy. Bro, I'm loving how they directing this because they got a little bit of shaky cam just to show you how chaotic this whole thing is, but you can still tell what the f is going on. God damn. It was perfect. Perfect. Everything down to the last minute details. There's a lot of censoring that's going to have to go along with this scene, bro. Oh my God. <laughs> And I'll say this is a perfect music choice. <laughs> oh, <sh> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> this is too much going on right here. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> my god the impact oh my goodness this is a lot that was fire <laughs> oh shit my god no 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 and the fact that they did this in a church is crazy i have a feeling everybody had the exact same reaction as the characters in this movie where they were just like speechless mouths dropped it's like those 
old movies we both love. Now I'm gonna tell you my whole plan, and then I'm gonna come up with some absurd and convoluted way to kill you, and you'll find an equally convoluted way to escape. <laughs> well, this ain't that kind of movie. Oh, shit! I really didn't think he was gonna die, bro. Okay, this villain right here is fire. He has definitely brought up the stakes. So what is his next target? Like, what is the range on this whole thing? Now, what's crazy is the fact that they did something like that, but I have seen the trailers and this dude isn't dead because it seemed like he's pretty much the face of Kingsman because I don't know if he came back to do any of the other movies after the second one. I think they only did like three, four movies, I forget. This is some shit, bro. Valentine can send his signal to any of them, all of them. If they all go homicidal at the same time, then... Indeed. And thanks to Galahad's recordings, we have Valentine's confession. But are y'all really going to be able to do That's anything? Because he has a lot of politicians in his pocket. I think the only way that you'll be able to do something is if you put him on blast in front of everybody. I was very fond of you. <laughs> what the hell? Diesel. So this dude probably even... This dude probably deleted yeah. the footage. What the... F Come on, bro. I wouldn't even have drunk that as soon as I saw that scar. Valentine won you over. Once he explained, I understood. Global warming is the fever. Mankind is the virus. This dude is going a whole lot more insane and extreme than Thanos was. Because Thanos was just vanishing people. This dude is really trying to cause a worldwide massacre. And then the fact that you get all these people with these Sims cards, and we just found out that even people who don't have the Sims cards can be affected. You can literally kill basically everybody. Sometimes the culling is the only way to ensure that the species survives. This shit is fire, bro. Usually movies like this, the villain will have a plan that's kind of like eh, this plan right here is crazy i'd rather be with harry thanks so be it did he switch his glasses okay that's smart as f oh my god the question is what are we gonna do god knows who's in valentine's pocket and who's not we're gonna have to deal with this ourselves. Yo, this has to be one of the best movies I've seen in a minute, bro. When it comes to just the action and the story. This house really reminds me of Professor Xavier's house. Seems the implant can emit some kind of counter signal to ensure the wearer remains unaffected by the waves from the SIM card. But what he probably didn't tell anyone is it can also superheat their soft tissue at his command. What about um, him being able to monitor them though? Because with Mark Hamill, he was able to see certain stuff and hear things, so. You can do this. Okay. Yeah. Exit. Come on, time is not our friend. Come on, bro. Let me spit my game, bro. Shoot, the world can wait. It's like everybody cock blocking this man, bro. Trying to talk to Roxanne. 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 You don't have to. Hey, yo. I just want to remind you that today is a day of celebration. The birth of a new age. That's so messed up, man. I kind of would like to see this whole thing happen just to see how the world is going to be in chaos. But at the same time, man, I don't know if I'm ready for all that gore. Hey, you looking pretty chapped, bro. Dude, that's good, bro. Yeah, this dude looks really sus because you just had somebody in a suit and glasses like that looking real nice and they were uh, trying to figure out who he was. So then you have somebody else like this show up. You be like, huh, I don't know about this guy. How'd you get online? I couldn't. Oh, well, it's a closed network. You see pre-authorized connections only. I think I'm still on my last time zone. Oh yeah, yeah, let's see now. You couldn't be a little bit more subtle with that, sir? See? Nice and slow. That's your fault. Damn it. <laughs> oh my God, just had to have somebody like that. <laughs> that just had to be some bullshit that this dude is there, bro. But that would make sense for why he would be caught though. There's so much going on right here, man. It's got my heart racing, bro. Oh, oh my God. Oh. Oh my God, I love the combat roles. Bro, see, movies like this is what made me want to be an actor, bro. I want to be a part of stuff like this. And then, you know, just be in the movie theaters and see myself on the big screen doing shit like this. Oh my God. I would be freaking going through so many different emotions. Nice. Good job, bro. <laughs> Got it with the clutch. <laughs> That's amazing. Right on time. Oh no, no, 
there's no way I can hack past that. What are you talking about, man? You're one of the main characters. You can do it. We're Wait, the good what? guys. We can do whatever we can. You're going to have to get in there and make sure his hand never touches that desk. Are, are you, you serious? serious? You can tell me that on my way there? We have earpieces. I'm taking all of it. Good choice. Out of all the weapons, you only choose that one? Come on, bro. I would have got both pistols and I would have got that. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, that explosion looked like something that would be in the 90s, bro. There's too much going on, bro. I don't even know how this dude could win. Remember those implants you said were of no use to us? Any chance you can turn them on? Oh, that's smart as fuck. Yo, I didn't even think of that. This movie is on point. Oh my God, that is gross. Oh my God. <laughs> this editing is on point. Damn. Bravo, bro. Aren't you that princess that we're missing? You can't get me out. I've always wanted to kiss a princess. If you get me out right now, I'll give you more than just a kiss. Oh, hell yeah, dude. we can go ahead and get into that room. That's what I'm saying, get in that room quick as hell. really think I was stupid enough to implant one of those things in my own head? God damn, bro, they always cop blocking. I can't do nothing. Oh, so we about, we about to see some sh I kind of really want to see it in the baseball stadium, to be honest with you. Sorry, love, you gotta save the world. If you save the world, we can do it in the asshole. No, uh... I'll be right back. Didn't know the princess was like that. Damn. Okay, well, they showing me what I wanted to see. God damn. I just love how they shoot the action. So he has to have his hand on the desk the whole time? That's kind of stupid. You didn't think about that, sir? <laughs> that shot is fire as fuck. Bro, this is one of the best action movies I've ever seen, bro. Yes, there we go. That's the shot I wanted to see. God damn, that looks crazy. Yo, that dude freaking did a flip over somebody. Shoot, well, they succeeded somewhat because I already know probably a little bit over a million people have died already. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, bro. I would be in awe and be like, damn, this girl right here is fire. <laughs> this is crazy. It's crazy how all these people are fighting like they have been trained by some martial artists. I can understand why the sequels haven't been as good as the first one, because I've heard that they were really bad. Because this movie right here is damn near a masterpiece, bro. What? Damn, man, she's so fine, bro. She did not deserve to die. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. What a freaking third act, bro. This ain't that kind of movie, bruv. Oh, yeah, I love that line. That's way better. Oh, that's nice. I appreciate that, man. That's considerate. Yeah, y'all earned that. There's no need for champagne. We got loads in the plane. Oh, yeah, the princess. I forgot. I thought he was bringing that for uh, his homeboy. XZ. Oh, they really showing this? <laughs> They dude immediately went into the ass, bro. I would have, you know, got up in the, the main thing first, you know. Got me Don't let your kids watch it. Yeah, that's that's how it would have been. Michelle Turner, office doing my nutting. Finally, bro. He deserves some bullshit. I'm going to shove your manners up your f <laughs> We got to do the same thing here. Are we going to stand around here all day or are we going to fight? So, well, yeah, I guess there's no point in showing that action scene if it's just gonna be the same thing like in the earlier part of the movie. Yo, that's beautiful, bro. Rest in peace, Kathy, man. Shoot, this dude made a movie for his mom. I would love to do something like that myself, especially even for my grandmother, too. This is beautiful. This is one of the best movies I've ever seen. That directing was on point. I I don't think I've ever seen an action scene directed like that, bro. I, I loved all the action scenes in this movie, man. All right, everybody, there we go with Kingsman, bro. This movie was on point, one of the best movies I've ever seen. I'm definitely giving this movie an A+. Bro, the action scenes 
were fantastic. Some of the best action scenes I've ever seen. I love the dialogue. I love the acting. A lot of the characters have great chemistry with each other. This movie makes me excited to watch the other movies that came afterwards, but I just, I've heard so many bad things about a lot of those movies that I just really don't feel like wasting my time right now. Like I'll probably watch them eventually, but to just rush into them and watch them, uh, I'll probably just hold off on that, man. But I cannot wait to hear y'all thoughts. You know, which movie is y'all favorite? Cause you know, everybody's different. There's probably some people that like the sequels better than the original, man. The villain was fantastic. Even though the villain didn't really do that much is just having Samuel Jackson there with his presence and just the dialogue that he was saying and the decisions that they had this villain do in this movie that was completely different from a lot of other villains, which was great. Cause you know, they were also, you know, poking fun at some of the other spy movies and just how how they always went about a certain type of way and this is one of those type of movies that we really need you know every once in a while that's just so much fun and just has you forget about all the, the bs that's happening in the world bro uh i was really not expecting how gruesome this movie was and what they showed right there at the end bro i was not expecting that either but i, I uh, appreciate it so uh if y'all would like to see my full length reaction to this movie the other movies i do tv shows i do you can click the link down below in the description to my patreon and follow me on all my social medias links will be down in the description below and with all of being said i'll see you on the next one all right peace